Yeah, still got a lot of things to do here. Point. Ah, oh, this viewpoint. Yeah. In that fragment. Is there a way to climb through here? Climbable. Oh, is it? There's another fragment. Right. I see some things that look climbable. How do I get that? Fragment is over there. Okay, this is cover. We got two people guarding a manuscript. Mayan Dresden Codex. Ancient Mayan Codex still extant, currently being held in Dresden, once owned briefly by the wealthy plantation owner, Peter Beffert. I know, that's it. NASA, originally founded as another... There were several attempts to found a town near the Havana Bay in the early 1500s. The settlement was established by the Spanish conquistador Diego Valesquez de Culier around 1514. The city sits on a bay that opens to the Gulf Stream and thus became a natural stopping point between Europe and the Americas. Hmm. In the early stages of the Golden Age of Piracy, Havana was burned to the ground by French corsair Jacques de Soares by the 1700s. Havana was a large, heavily fortified port city where Spanish treasure ships would dock on their way to Europe. Pirates lurked on the approaches to the city, hoping to capture these same ships. No, I've been trying to get the Cuban government in on this one to walk tourism angle, but they don't seem to understand MKTG at all. Marketing. Originally founded as another Charlestown, the city was renamed Nassau in honor of King William III of the House of Orange Nassau. The city has a particularly colorful past. In 1706, the city's officially appointed governor skipped down, thus severing the crown's direct control over the Bahamas. The islands languished for almost a decade in the hands of British citizens with little or no interest in statesmanship. By 1713, the entire region had become a haven for pirates, and it was in this period that Benjamin Hornigold declared Nassau to be a pirate republic. He proclaimed himself governor, and thereafter every pirate of any sense and reputation used Nassau as a base of operation forming this small city of barely a thousand residents into a nest of infamous bastards, according to the governor's Bermuda, Governor Bermuda. 
No, it's great fun in the public, public as a hell of that, but Tony was all bogus. It's so wonderful. I mean, not wonderful for the people that got murdered, ravished and marooned, but fantastic for our purposes. This gives us an income. Okay, there's another way through here. Maybe, I mean, I see this is supposed to be some kind of thing. This. No, that's just a way to get back here and then here and then there. It's under me, okay. <coughs> Walk the thing. Now I want that. Actually, that'll be easy to see. I want that. Hmm. No. No. Up. Up there, <coughs> climb. Over here, climb this. And then I'm back. Can you go up? Of course it is. I want that box. Alarm bell. fragment. I don't see any courier. I think I know how this one goes. <coughs> Fine, let's get the coil. That's straight, Captain Kenway. 
better than that. It's you, Edward. I, I, I. Uh... Why are you like this? Okay. If we forget to play like games, uh, no, I think we'll just go for the main mission now. Climb the thing. <sighs> Try not to sound like a grandpa. Colors, places, and plunder. Morning, Kenway. Not a bad looking tinder box you got there. You sound a bit green, horny gold. Is it envy? Because mine's bigger than yours. No, I reckon it's this Jamaican funk. I prefer the Spanish stuff. So, you've got yourself a fancy brig now. Fine. Well, I'm going to teach you how to sail all right. And how to take a prize the proper way. Oh, really? Thatch, we'll catch you up at the old fishing village. Aye. Right. Oh, the missus subscribed. Thank you. Thank you very much for the support. I'll contact Where's you later. Where's your helmsman, Kenway? I take pride in piloting my own ships, Ben. Uh, well, you deserve a prize for being the first subscriber. Uh, I'll message you later. Thank you for subscribing. Um, controls, ship controls, my glass. Okay. Keeps me alert. Let's make some headway, shall we? There's a prize worth taking. Good! Take us in close. After you subdue a prize, project authority. Demand respect that you would never give yourself. This weaves a spell over soft minds. For your victims must always have in the back of their minds the uneasy idea that you could snap uh, at check any the giveaway command. and unseen them from prick to sternum. Oh, sail. hang on a second. Human flotsam. More sail! All sail! I know she's a good sailor. Now prove it, my trumps! Uh, yes, I do. But I don't have an invitation here. I'll need to make one. Like different weapons, yeah. I want to incapacitate it, not destroy it. Try to change shot to the front of the ship. Muzzle that duck, my trunks! Yeah! 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 Give me chain shots. Fire! 
Yeah, that was a little bit too much incapacitate. Come on. Um. Okay. Ship incapacitated. The ship is on fire. It means it's incapacitated. You can either get close and board, or to get all the cargo, or sink it and take half the cargo. Loose mainsail! All of your Hold down! Hold down! We'll bathe in your blood! Blow on every inch of sail! Hold them down! Let's get them! Hold them! Hold them! Come on! Ow. I should wait a bit before I just jump in the water. Where's your helmsman, Kenway? I take pride in piloting my own ships, Ben. Keeps me alert. Let's make some headway, shall we? I've no need for schooling. How many prizes did we take together as privateers? <laughs> There's a chasm of difference between joining a raid and captaining one. We're looking out for merchants, boys! Them that's fat with cargo! Find us a schooner with that spyglass, Kenway. I You'll get one. yourself a glimpse of what sort of cargo they're oh. shipping and a general idea of their toughness. There's a prize worth taking. Good! Take us in close. After you subdue a prize, project authority. Demand respect that you would never give yourself. This weaves a spell over soft minds. For your victims must always have in the back of their minds an uneasy idea that you could snap at any moment and unseen them from trick to stern. Use chainshot to slow her! I'm using chainshot. Ready to fire, sir! Loose a swim to! They're not moving. Fire! Fire! Get the main screen! Fire! Okay, ship incapacitated. We're Let's going to hit them! Drag them to that doom! Pull them in! Que tengo un buen día, señor. I am Captain Hornigold, and this is my crew. We're sailors like yourselves, but quite unalike in our purpose. For we intend to take all that you own. Yet no harm shall befall any man so long as he remains at ease. Is that clear? No me mate, señor. Tengo familia. Se lo suplico. Anyone speak English? English? Little bit. Tell your friends we're stealing your goods. And we won't hurt nobody if everyone stays as still as a sandbar. You got that? <laughs> Please to repeat. Oh, for fuck's sake. <laughs> Lock him in the hold and take everything that isn't nailed down. I just like for me. What should we do with the ship? Take all the loot, repair the jackdaw. That's it, and add it to my fleet. Bye bye. We now have the materials required to make the ship stronger, sir. It's a shaky feeling sailing about with this much stolen cargo. Get used to it. We'll need to take a few more prizes to make this a profitable day. 
gather cargo from where? This is a shipwreck. Contains an upgrade plan. Let's hit that one. Every last scrap of duck. Um, what do we have here? It's a wreck. Fire bells. Nah, gunboat. 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 Captain has some business. Captain has the helm. Okay, let's try and do that contract, shall we? Whatever the hell it is. Fast travel. Fast travel. Unavailable. Because why Control would it be? What's that? Wood cloth. Scudo. Okay, we found the jackdaw. Well done, lads. A good take today, can we? 
half a dozen scores of that size and you'll be set for a year now let's sell this cargo and fix up your jack door with a few more trinkets sod it you i'm looking for a prize that will set me up for life I'll be king of the west indies then we came to nassau to get away from the likes of kings well i'll be a man of property and promise anyway jesus let that dream go lad nassau is the place to be not england do you ever dream of the big score? A ship so full of gold and silver, you just split it and sail home. Hmm. Sure, but it's only a dream. Every man hopes to find a dozen chests of gold with no owners. Hmm. But they're as rare as an honest king. Hmm. I'm having a bad throat ache. Done about. Not worth anything. Schooner level four. Cloth and round. to work on the driving thing. Okay, target, stay out of combat. Come on. Many people so little interesting stuff.
Okay, not really worth my time anymore. Right, treasure map. I'm at 612, 831. 606, 835. 606, 835. Can I just put a marker without targeting anything? <coughs> Okay, head north something. In the middle of the trees. How do I know the six eight thirty five are not there yet? Need to go more north. Slightly south and to the west. A thirty five Pixel six should be over here. single island. Maybe it's that one over there. Come here. How much do I need for the next upgrade? Humpback whale, deer hide, wild pig. I can hunt a wild pig. Good here. So I think it's that thing.
Uh huh. Dig. Just dig. Captain's home. English gunboats. Cruise up! Ease her steps! Dose the topsails! Wait. You want to flotsam? Lusor, let's move! Unfurl aloft! Now your sheets! Human flotsam! Trim the yards off the wind! Ease the spanker! Hold down! Well, as much time as you can! Disabled. That's Close one. down, man your sheets. Let's see if we can grab a hold. They're fearful tags to us, sir. No quarter. Pack them Give me some speed. Yo, heave on. Heave. Heave. Pull her close. Keep my death Well, pirates are gonna fire it. Oh, well, what could I Tell your own to go to the hubmaster or in your captain's cabin. Hold tight, here they come! What are they doing? Isn't this my cap captain's cabin? Captain's trick. Fire! Fire! They are no match for us! Tops! Gallants! Royals! Studs! What? What is synchronization? Ease off the wind! Ease the main muzzle of the gallants! No quarter! Pack them all to bits! Ready! Trucks ready to go! Ready! Brace yourselves for freedom! Really Ready, trucks! Ja, 
Lock them in. By an intermediate hull. English gunboat, English gunboats. Are they hostile? Why are you hostile? Targeting me. Oh, mortals. Or oh, fire bells. Fire! That cliff will break us, sir! Ah, crap! Sorry. Yourselves. Still alive, Captain. Nothing. Playing school now. That's not a Spanish school. No. Shoot, shoot.
grown up by the reggae. Spaniards! They're all alone, sir. I'm sailing. What's that? Civilian ship. Toast the gallants and royals! Brief the mains! Clue up gallants! Every last scrap of duck on the wind! Stand Zeus! Let's ride this wall! Civilian. What is this place? Down, all sail! Ahoy aloft! Bring it all in! Bring us in! That's how you park a ship. <laughs> Salt Key Bank. Oh, master. Willing to deal with me now? Algo? Okay. Nothing to sell. Nothing to repair. Jackdaw upgrades. All armor. Intermediate hull. Not a bad take today. Keep this up and Nassau will be the first city where men and women may live as God made them. Easy and free. All it takes is a few drops of blood, sweat, and a swatch of cloth. We fly no colors out here, but praise the lack of them. So let the black flag signal nothing but your allegiance to man's natural freedoms. This one's yours. Light proud. I Thanks, will. Touch. I hand over the docket I lent you. If we're to keep our Republic afloat, we'll need guns as well as gold. That means attacking the Navy. So long as they're flying King Philip's colors will not offend our own monarch. Yeah, don't attack the British. But wait, as you've done. likely seen, the number of merchants roving these waters is three score the number of military ships. Aye, easy purchase, but in small doses. Right. So to lure the Navy out of hiding, it's best to cause a bit of mischief. Catch a few small fish to attract the big ones. That's right. So plunder and pillage as you see fit, Captain Kenway. Hmm. Hang on a minute. I'm not done with this place. Pretty big place. What do you got for me? Hey. <laughs> cool, let's start a fight.
Okay, that was fun. But anything else? Bienvenido. Un hombre de mi posición se entera de ciertas cosas. Okay. Ever convoy. Entonces, ¿de qué vas? Somewhere there. I see it. Eh, okay. No. Contract. The right hand man of a powerful slain trader is believed to be headed towards the Matanas Matanazas Matanzas plantation for some dodgy business. Find the target, kill him. Climb it. Yeah, it doesn't look like such a big place. Two contracts, six chests, one song sheet, fragments. Lower wanted level. Low, low, shanty I want. Then the fragment. See what you're doing there. <coughs> no, up, up, up. Fragment. <coughs> and the box. Well, the box. Yet. Fishermen's villages. Small villages not 
dot the hundreds of islands of the West Indies, generally made up of just a few shacks. Let us consider these villages to be safe spots to collude and regroup unhindered. Let us establish semi-permanent camps for the crew return to repair their ships and divide their spoils. Where do I get that? I missed something. No, come on. That's the all the boxes. Let's take all of them. Not gonna be back here, probably. <laughs> no, can't kill goat. Can't kill chimkins. Chimkins. Goat. Goat. Bear. And the last thing. Latin contracts. But I'm gonna have another quick go with the harbor master. What? Nothing? Si me necesita, estaré por aquí. Fine. Who are you? Ship. Look at the ship. 
Uh, look at the locations, see everything available there. Huh. Okay. Maybe I will switch it back to V. Um Oh well that 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 works too. Let's go now. Sail ho! Military class brig on the horizon! Good eye, man. Are you ready for this, Kenway? She won't go down without an honest fight. Who's up for taking that brig, lads? Show die! That's a sound I like to hear. Pipe to quarters. All hands to cannons. Wait. Careful around the Navy. They're as likely to ram you as fire a broadside. Let's test those powder barrels against them, shall we? Aye, good thinking. Chasing under after blowing things. Take that one. Fire! Yeah! We're ready, sir. Use, use. Take us for colliding. Fire! Damn! Got the angle wrong. Um.
Thank you, Kuma, boss. That was a rumble, by God. How do we fare? A fine purchase, no mistake. Now, I think it's time to lay low and bribe our way back into secrecy. Hmm. Yeah, I think I'll do the contract first. So, how do we get rid of this notoriety we've stirred up? Money, my boy. A well-placed bribe to the right government official will see the military off your tail. Right, let's do that. I'll need to meet these good Samaritans at some point. Smart thinking. Is that a hunter? Do I qualify as a hunting a hunter? No. Firm there, Captain! Look on every inch of sail! Let me at him. I know, I know, we're going for the hunter. It is firing! Yeah. Ow! Fire! F oh, no! 
Let's take that hunt out. Every last scrap of duck on the wind. More sail! Give me more sail! Mm. Reef in all top. Is the man bring them in for a steely kiss? bit more plundering to do. Out of shots. Join who wants to die. How's the ship doing? Ship's doing fine. Ah, that's my target. That's a level 23 frigate.
coming after us, sir. Fire! Jonah! There ain't Jonah! Hey! Nice, sir, good shot, good crippler. Fire! Fire! She's vulnerable there, Captain. Those the gallants and royals. Ready to fire! Fire! The order was to kill. Fire! Keep fire! I am not fighting a frigate. Not this early. What do we have here? What is that? Matanzas. Enemy ship. I think we're clear. Grip the yards off the wind. Okay. Lions Telates LA. Uh-huh. It's all guarded. It's a plantation. I should probably take out the gun of course. is over there. Got it. Fine. Give me ammo.
For all she's worth. Larboard, Captain. Seems like you're a survivor. Brace for impact. Do not let. Fatten yourselves. Brief the topsail. Trim off the wind, my boys! Ease her! We're beelining for the rocks! Fall down and clue up! Bring it all, sir! Gum and tight! Captain Dalt in himself! Captain, need to go underground? I can keep the heat up for a fee. Es un ejemplar en buena forma física. You need to vanish, friend. ¿Qué puedo hacer hoy por usted?
Quizá en otro momento.
You're a wonder, Kenway. You've a knack for this kind of work. It ain't work if you love it. Ah, ah, it's But I ain't doing this forever, lads. Only until I get enough coin to buy some land and influence back home. <laughs> Jesus, will you listen to your tripe? Still dreaming on about that strumpet back in England when you could have any better you wanted here and now. Ah, such lofty goals for you gents. And here I thought I was in the company of scoundrels. A fine purchase today. What's the crew's mood? All smiles and no teeth. And there's a few talking about meeting with Master Kid to steal from a nearby plantation. Plantation? That's ambitious. Profitable too, if we can manage it. Aye. It's a good idea. Planes out! Let's go! Ease off the wind! Mainmast! Bring in the top halyards! Pull! Get them along! Douse all sail! Stunts up with a will! Something I can assist with?
Jun. All the best. Why, look. It's the bastard son of the late William Kidd. Still a mere boy, and yet... Ten times the demon his father was. Fancy seeing you here, can we? Still looking sleek and mean. Did you steal that costume from a dandy in Havana? No, sir. I found this on a corpse. One that was walking about and talking shite to my face only moments before. Huh. So, what's this I hear about a planned raid on a plantation? Not keeping secrets from me, are you? Not very well. Every day, schooners packed with sugar sail past, coming from plantations nearby. Most times, they stop here, sell off a few crates. There's one man visiting today that had earned you a fine profit. So if you'd like to rob his plantation, I'll point him out. I would. Is it a Mr. Beckford that owns this plantation? That's the man. He owns dozens round these islands. And he's bloody rich. Just the sort I like to see robbed. His agent is around here somewhere. Find and follow him. And he'll lead you straight to your prize. me to hear your saying so. But despite the waywardness of your enterprise here, I understand that you are men of discernment. But despite Mr. Flynn's best efforts, expired in the night. I am sorry to make this discovery. Burford, Manning, to me. We've done with this place. Aye, sir. What's our course? We'll return to the plantation and there take stock of our inventory. It was a good harvest this year. You might not talk so loud, sir. This isn't anything like a friendly port, Ken. Nonsense, man. I had a delightful conversation with a chap just now. We came to quite an understanding. As you say, sir. All up and unfurl, boys. We're going home. <laughs> Captain, you have the look of a man crafting a bold idea. Well, look I've seen before. You mark well, Ade. I've just overheard one of the Beckford's men talking grandly about his plantation and all the cargo he's keeping there. And it gave me the idea that I might take these goods off him and sell them off for a better price than he'd ever ask. <laughs> ah, a man of vision. I like this idea. Our force patrol these waters closely, Captain. 
Hold at it. There's trouble afoot. I see them. Now, my trumps, I'd not haze you. Studs out. Let's get moving. Loose Reef the topsails and gallants. Reef the foremains. Crowd on every inch of sail. Unfurl aloft. Man your sheets. Enemy making for us. I think you're clear, sir. Tata. Royal Navy. Stouts all but mains. Stunsails in. Clue up. Every last scrap of duck on the wind! You ride the wind for all she's worth! Hostile wash! Reef in all tops! Ease the spanker! Hold down! man's working for Peter Backford's people. Do you know them? The Backfords and their sugar empire. Aye. The Backfords and the Draxes. I never worked their plantations, but I knew their names from hearing other men curse them. But you worked a plantation, no? A modest one, aye. As a striker in the boiling house. Boiling house? Was it water they boiled? Or something else? Cane juices. It's a hard process making sugar. Dangerous, too. Must be why it fetches such a dear price. What's it like? Toiling on a plantation day and night. Well, with the cane sugar cut and harvested, it's run between two metal rollers that crush the juice from the plant. After collecting the juice, it was time to boil away the waters from the sugar. This we did in tatches made of copper. But let me tell you, brother, boiling sugar is near the hottest thing on earth. Just a touch on the skin will stick like bird lime and burn on, leaving a terrible scar. Jesus. Dark skies and rough seas there! Fire! Fire! More sail! All sail! Close up! Eat. It's a risk to anchor too close. The soldiers roving the plantation would catch us for sure. Drop here then and sneak ashore. We'll look after the jackdaw. here why such disarray but if it do sir that's all it's Wellington's birthday 
And you saw fit to get pickled on duty. No bother, sir. We have everything sorted. We'll soon see, won't we? For you must double the watch this evening. Double, sir? Whatever for? I believe I was followed here, young man. By pirates, if my eyes on me. Though the ship was uncommonly large for such rascals. Certainly wasn't slavers, though. Not a ship that size. In any case, double the watch. And keep your damned eyes wide for anything suspicious. Life, man, you've a job to do. Apologies, sir. I'll keep my eyes peeled. For God's sake, what the hell is going on here today? How do you suppose you'll be able to ring that alarm if you're pissed drunk and barely able to stand? Forgive me, sir. I am fit and able. If I see any strangeness about. You'll hear the bell ringing straight away, I promise. man in charge here. I require entrance to the warehouse. Which of you dogs has the key to the warehouse, huh? Is there no one sober here? Fetch me the warehouse key, if you please. I didn't hire snails. Careful with that. The key, goddammit. Someone find me the key. Don't leave till it's done. Guess two pounds left to work the entire force. They'll be a welcome treat regardless of where they came from. Split me, no. I'm not a dull man. Give me a foosie and a target, and I'll do what's needed. But when then we currently disagree, I'll be trying to find out. Just let someone else do it. Who's taking it? Give over. He's vanished. Virginia, mostly guarding the college and such at Williamsburg under Governor Spotswood. A few skirmishes with poor heart and tribesmen rebelling against an enslavement, but nothing too bloody. Not a word, other than rumours of pirate activity. Just to have a few souls in all the dirt he's claiming.
Intruder! You're in the wrong place! He's trying to... Got a nerve, you bastard. Damn it, my mic was muted. <sighs> Upgrades. Sorry. Okay, time to loot the warehouse. Yeah, I need to get a better mic. Ooh, lots of stuff. Before I leave the island, fragment. Two fragments, one song sheet, one viewpoint. Second fragment. I didn't hire snails. Careful with that. And a view. 
viewpoint. Yeah, I, I want to buy a wave, but currently, probably because of pandemic prices, it costs about $250. I don't want to buy just any microphone. Shanty. Box, then shanty, then box. Then statue, then out of here. Okay, I see what it is, and I know what I need to do. That's a monkey. on an old PC today and I couldn't get the thing to stay on and I figured there was, was a switch because it didn't want to work well so I unplugged it and I thought temporarily I could plug something else in but I was a proprietary plug and I plugged it in back and it worked fine afterwards. Um, <laughs> that sounds like a real story. Okay, where's my monkey? The Rio Grande. The crocodile is a large tropical dwelling tetrapod. Crocodiles can measure up to 15 feet long, weigh up to 2,000 pounds, and live up to 70 years of age. This prehistoric looking predator preys on birds, fish, insects, and other reptiles. The species has survived the threat of multiple mass extinctions, and today remains classified as critically endangered. Crocodiles have been known to indulge in cannibalistic behavior. Because of this, they live in groupings of the same size. Not to be confused with alligators, crocodiles are bigger, lighter in color, and have narrow, narrower snouts. Although known to attack humans, the crocodile is more likely to flee than to react aggressively when approached. Well, someone is really into crocodiles and cannibalism. The crocodile can we encountered must have been especially bitey. Let me keep the focus more on the subjects whose ancestors or descendants impact his impacted history. Thank you. What kind of plug was it? That's what I'm interested in. <laughs> How does it uh... Switch plug for an, an Ultra Spark 60. So it's so it's unique. One more for the collection. And that's it for this island.
turn on but not stay on but for two seconds apparently I can even turn it back in what then that sounds like a dirty connector actually we have some contact fluid Go lads! Fire! Oh. Next objective is here. Lots of ships on the way. Let's try and find that. I don't know what that is. Aloft, lads. Check those royals. for the PC soon. Yeah, um, I, I figured out that my uh, handheld vacuum cleaner actually I said about the book on Pascal. No. Ah, local bookstore and so an old book for Pascal. Ah, sorry. Captain's home. Don't try to reach out and navigate the ship at the same time. Uh, the notebook for Pascal. I thought, oh, that's cool, and bought it even though I'll never use it. Clues down. Catch some wind. Yeah, I have. Actually, let me see I'm if I can show you. Let me see if I can show you. Uh, I need my camera. There we go. So that's my game shelf and my bookshelf. And it's full of books. And I've read like maybe maybe half of them. Actually maybe a quarter. And I try not to buy books unless I know I'm gonna read them. I try not to buy games unless I know I'm gonna play them. So that's a big problem for me. Yeah, I mean, Pascal, actually learning pretty much anything today, why use a book for that? You can get anything on the internet. Uh, you can get courses and videos and... Especially Pascal, who uses Pascal anymore? I actually tried learning basic from books, and I tried learning uh, some C from books, but never did me any good. Oh, tortoise! No, tortoise are not huntable. Right now, if I want to learn something, which is mostly... Come here! Come here! Damn it! Right now if I want to learn something, for example, I want to improve my skills in Unity, I just go to Unity's learn platform and do a project. Lines? I 
And I actually find that lately, like in the last year or so, I really have no no patience for actually reading. I listen to audiobooks and the news. I use more uh, text to speech. More deer hunting. I want a fragment and a secret. Another bullet. I can shoot the pistol. Probably makes more sense to learn from video, but these books have a certain charm. Yeah, I have a lot of friends who just like. Ooh, cutting available. Oh, turtle doesn't give me anything. Sorry, turtle. Uh, I get people who like books just for them being books. I have a few friends with that particular issue. And I understand that this paper is cool. But I don't have the affinity for stuff just because of stuff only for content okay oh right the secret Favor. 442118 near the windmill. Hmm. Okay. I actually think I need to stop here because there are other things I need to do. But thanks for watching. This was a nice conversation. Uh, I call this the 99% because, for example, I'm not going to hunt every little thing if it's not convenient. I mean, this world is huge. It's enormous. And some things aren't that easy. Some things require backtracking. And I hate backtracking. So if it's on my way, I'm going to get it. Hey, this is the chest in the middle of nowhere. On the way, I'll get it. If not, so be it. And even the 100% completion on missions. If it's too much, then I just won't do it. So that's it. Uh, yeah. Thanks for watching. I'll probably do this again tomorrow. Same time, same channel. Uh, stay good. Have fun. Bye bye.